In this problem, we're asked to set up the left-sided Riemann sum for this integral from 1 to 5 of 1 over x squared dx with 100 slices. So this, this is actually a picture of all 100 slices. And again, we're going from x equals 1 all the way to x equals 5. Now to get some of this stuff written down, the delta x and the xi, I'm going to put some notation in here. We normally call the starting position x0 and the finishing position xn, which is x100 in this case. And then the subinterval width, delta x, you just take the total width, 5 minus 1, and divide by how many slices you're slicing it into. That's 4 over 100, which I could write it in decimal form as 0.04. So there's that piece. And then xi is a notation for the ith cut point, and that's the starting position x0 plus i steps to the right. So the starting position in this case is 1 plus i steps to the right. And the step size is delta x, which we already computed. So this looks like 1 plus 0.04i. Now I want to wrap up the summation notation for the left sum. And this is going to be like a f of xi for a height times delta x, but I need to make sure that I'm measuring height at the correct part. So that like the height of the first rectangle is measured at x0. So I need to start this sum at 0 and go to 99 to get 100 total rectangles. Just a real quick check. When I plug in the upper limit, I get f of x 99, which is 1 to the left of that last one, which is good because I'm trying to measure the height of each rectangle at the left-hand side. I then plug in the details of this function, like what's f, and the function f is 1 over x squared, so I get 1 over xi squared, and I go back and look up what's xi, so 1 over 1 plus 0.04i squared multiplied by delta x, which is 0.04. So now I actually have a sum that I can explicitly add up and get an approximation for this area. So I opted to use maxima for this. So let's pop up maxima real quick. Okay, here we are in maxima, and I've typed in sum of 0 0.04, that's from over here, times 1 over the quantity 1 plus 0.04i all squared as i goes from 0 to 99. It all looks good. I hit Shift-Enter, and I get an area approximation of 0 0.819.